Welcome to another Ride Along with Goggles, Cab Over Monday. And, uh, well, here we are. We got a, it's, uh, don't know if it's going to be done in time for the video or not. It's still kind of a work in progress. As um, I have, um, haven't lined the stripes up around the back of the cab or anything. And there might be a few other things. But it's the uh, Overfloater K100, the Kings County truck lines on it. And this garage mod is pretty much done too. Uh, I put it up on Truckee. I'm not sure how it uploaded or not. I'm not super familiar with Truckee. But we've got seven trailers. So we got the milk uh, or food food grade trailers in two lengths. Uh, we've got cattle pot. We've got two different um, hoppers, uh, 43 and a 48. We got a step side, um, what is it, 53? And we should have a 53 foot reefer. There's one over there. And what else are we missing here? Uh, oh, there's two food tankers. Yeah, right. So one, two, there's two of those, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, seven trailers. So, uh, and what's really cool is they're in the, um, they're in the job market. So what we're going to do, I want to pull one of those cattle pots. So that'd be kind of cool. So all of these trailers, if we go look for a job, oops, not world map, job market, freight market. And Emporia, there should have been a cattle job there. Uh, let's see. Oh, there it is. Is that the right one? Yeah, that's the one I wanted. We got four hours to go get it. So we got uh, recon stuff here, I believe. Uh, Emporia to Colby. So we can set that as our destination. And I'll probably fly over there because I don't want to miss it. It's four hours. And so what I'll do, I'm going to pause the video and run over there and get in the yard. And then we'll, we'll hook up that trailer. And we're going to I'll pull a load right out of the freight market with a, a oh, a painted trailer. Before we go, let's, uh, let's wheel up to the gate and show you the signs and stuff. Oh, and there's 389s too. Uh, but I don't know, none showed up at this yard. It's all random what shows up in the yards. So there's our sign. Uh, Kings County. And both sides. That's kind of neat. And on the door of the building. So, uh, yeah, let's go jump into the... Um, I'm sorry, I'm going to pause. I'll fly over. Get, get in the yard, we'll hook up and we'll go. So I will be right back. Well, I came over and found the site. It's just right off the road. You just pull in down this, uh, this uh, hill here. And I actually flew into the yard, so I'm all cockeyed. So let's see if we, if we actually have the job. The one we wanted, there it is with our trailer. So we're gonna take the job. Parking brake on. It's going to be tough to pull this thing out of here, I think. Definitely going to be a low. Arrived, President Waves in. It's going to be a low gear job. Commands. Let's roll. We owe it to our children to have you arrive safely. That is pretty cool. We got a painted trailer in traffic. Don't even have to. Don't even have to own it. So let's throw this thing in low gear. See if we can get out of here. Got to see which way we're going. We're hanging it right. Get rid of that thing. Wow. Here we go. See how we do. It's not too heavy. Thirty-four thousand. It's a question of traction too. That is a cool yard. Very cool. Oh, wait a minute. How's my gear shifter set up? I'm not even sure what kind of transmission I have in here. I haven't been in here for a while. 
Uh, what are we doing? 18 speed. Okay, let's just see what we've got going here with the. Okay, it's an 18 speed. And we're going straight. Alright, let's roll. Oh man, I wish I had time to stop and look at the flowers here with the camera. Gotta get rolling. Kind of a scenic spot though to put a, a ranch. Or, um, sorry, uh, I guess a. Oh, what the heck do you call that again? Sort of a pasture style pickup. Uh, corral? Well, there was quite a bit. Of, there was some permanent pens there, it looked like. So it wasn't a temporary thing. It's down still. Oh, that's far out. I'm pretty uh, happy with the way this garage came up. I don't know if I've managed to upload it to Truckee or not. I, uh, I attempted to. I went to Truckee and I didn't see it. Maybe it takes a while. So I'm trying uh, Slav Jerry's 3406E uh, B again. Keep right and pin exit right. Looks like we're in the right lane. Okay. Exit right. Turn right. Keep right. Emporia is the town I wanted to make the uh, McGinty's trucking skin out of. I just thought such a cool name needed a trucking company out of there. And uh, what happened was I saw that uh, we're going to get uh, Joplin, Missouri sooner or later when Missouri comes out and Joplin is right on Route 66. And it was famous in the song and everything, and I thought, oh, dang. I'll make that uh, McGinty's for uh, Missouri, uh, Joplin, Missouri. And I'll make another skin out of uh, Emporia one of these days. sound recording so we sorted out a this is Sunday I, uh, evening I'm making this video and I didn't get it I didn't get a chance to work on the sound today because I was kind of wrapped up in making that yard skin so to reiterate there's seven trailers and they're gonna they should be we should be seeing some of these things in traffic sooner or later uh, depending you know, we've got 305 miles to go hopefully we see some and uh, Keep left. that should be interesting. And you can get any one of those in the job market. But boy, having a a painted SCS trailer for your own company—that's kind of cool. Continue straight. I should take a photo right along here of this thing. Continue straight. Yeah, that is so cool. Oh yeah, I gotta put the little pinstripes on the front of the truck too. But yeah, picking up uh Oh, there we go, we got uh Barnstormer coming over. Perfect timing. Continue straight. Nice. Keep right. 
Oh, uh, yeah. oh, there goes the reefer. Or no, that was, uh, wait, wait, was that the reefer? The tarp side. That was the uh, tarp side. And there was a uh, loose W900 ahead of it. So there's some loose trucks in traffic too, the 389 and the uh, W900. Boy, the, uh, man, the, the things that you do with this uh, garage mod. Like, oh, here comes, no, that's an old school. Yeah, looking forward to, like, I mean, now that I know what I'm doing with the garage mod, <laughs> I sure didn't last week. And I was saying, oh boy, it looks like you can only have four trailers and... Oh, there's a 389 in traffic. Um, yeah, I was just all over the map with it. I didn't have a clue what I was talking about. If I let anybody astray, I apologize. So I've, uh, oh boy, I've since learned what's going on with it. Is he really going to pass or is he going to just sit there? Get up beside him and put some pressure on? I don't know. Don't think that's going to work. He's too far up here now. Yeah, I gave up my spot in the lane. Yeah, that was brilliant. Yeah, so uh, hopefully I can get this sound mixed properly for this video. I'm not even, I didn't listen to yesterday's video to see. I just, I don't really have time to do that. I, uh, I'll just see what, it, oh shoot, gotta get Keep in the right, right lane here. And then exit right. say reefer right there so we're seeing about the right number in traffic it seems it's not like it's too much or anything so far and we're seeing a variety I don't think I've seen the same trailer twice yet so Well, I didn't get a chance too much driving uh, this weekend with all the uh, recording and audio issues I've been having. I just hope uh, we're putting that behind us. I still need to learn how to use the uh, equalizer feature in the uh, sonar software, but uh, we'll have to see how big an emergency we have with that when I uh, check the quality of this video. I'll decide what to prioritize next. Get more skins finished. Got a lot of skins just sort of sitting there, partially done, almost ready to go. This garage mod coming along kind of put a hold on some of that. 
But there's a lot of cool, you know, this skin here could definitely appear on a lot of vehicles in the future. And the fun thing is, like I say, you don't need modified trailers or anything or whatever. It's no biggie. Just, you don't have to build a trailer. You just go in the job market. So this company is uh, the original company. They've been bought out since their, oh, when was it, 70s or 80s? I'm not even sure, 90s? I'd have to look it up again. But it was founded in 1940. And uh, Weimer corrected me on the pronunciation. It's not Tulare, it's Tulare, California, I believe, or Tulare, Tulare. He even put all the little accent things to help me out. Yeah, I forgot, but thanks for that, Weimer. And, um, yeah, so it's basically agriculture. And it, well, sorry, it's hauling milk is their big deal. But I made the, just for the sake of expanding the business in the game and making it uh, logical to do a bunch of stuff with it, I made it uh, agricultural. So we got the hopper bottoms, we got the two lengths, two length milk tanker, got the, um, we do have a reefer to haul on refrigerated goods, uh, the cattle trailer, milk trailers, food grade trailers, sorry. So. kind of neat that we can have uh, uh, the uh, yard trucks and AI trucks both in the same mod. I can put AI trailers in, but I decided to uh, just keep it all the yard, the standalone trailers. And it's kind of a mis- what do you call that? Just uh, Where they call it a standalone trailer because we can pull them. So they do stand there alone in the yard. We have trucks assigned to them, yard trucks that appear and hook up to them and get parked in the yard. Then we have those same trucks, but I renamed them to a different name and call them AI. Oh, there's a plane again. Nice. So, yeah, it's kind of interesting how you do all that. And another thing, look at this sky. Have we had a sky like that before? I don't think so. Why do they keep sneaking this stuff up on us in the... Uh, micro updates we've got, got a couple of goggles AI traffic pack vehicles ahead of us all three of them Mulligans looks like Flatbed Brothers in Hell Creek So I got to add uh, four uh, through doing these mods with the uh, the um, the Hell Creek Trucking Garage mod has two trucks in it, and this one has two trucks in it. So I've added four more patrons' names to the doors of the trucks. So I've got four more patrons. Thanks for that in the game. So we just passed two of them back there and here's another one up here. I can't remember who's on all the trucks though. We'll see when, if we can, oh, we're gonna have to turn off. Keep right, 
Oh, he's, exit right. he's going right too. Let's go jump up there and see if I can see who is on the driver's exit door. Right. In 400 meters, turn right. Turn right. That sky's changing too. If you noticed, uh, clouds were a little puffier when I pointed it out earlier. Now it's becoming a steadier overcast. Interesting. Why, they just... There's a crop duster. All of the things they're adding to the game as we go along are pretty amazing. You compare this to when 149 Beta came out to what it is now. The game is just it's improved step by step quite a bit. Now where we're going is Colby. Colby Bazaar. Cattle pens. Wow. No, no, no. Candy cattle. Where we did the pickup was the bizarre cattle pens. Cool. In 400 meters, turn left. Turn left. Passed here a bunch, a bunch of times. That yeah, I commented back then. That looks like a place where we can do something. Or driver 47 either or. Yeah, look at this cool little truck. I guess I'll have to do a conventional, but. If I have the uh, big uh, long train mod in here or not, he's coming from that away. There he is. Oh, he's going pretty quick. A little logs. Well, just an SCS train. Some logs. Looks like Recon's been logging again. <laughs> I'm going to go in there. I guess I better go up to the intersection. Turn left. Nice of the sun to come out. In 400 meters, turn left. Turn left. Oh, easy now. That's a railway track there, Morgan. Oh. But that's all marked out for us. Should have signaled right. there. It's been my honor and duty to see you through this mission. Hey, look at this place. Another cool site. Wow. I like that, you know, 
I like the um, unique nature of a lot of these sites that uh, Recon and Driver 47 do. Like they're, it's not just the same thing over and over. That's cool. Oh, going to go a little wide here. Probably a good thing. I think we got to be slightly offset in the box here. Get this gate lined up. Oh, it might be too much. Yep. That'd be too much. Not gonna squeeze these girls out there. Oh. Now we're going too tight. God darn it. We'll get it sooner or later here. Be a little bit cockeyed. I'll just jump back there and see if they can get the gals out. No, it's. Yeah, it'll work. Well, we should, uh, real quick, let's have a quick look at the trailer. So you can do the light box. It's not lit up, though, like the uh, aftermarket trailers or the mod trailers. But still cool. You can put it on there. I could take that Kings County off the front of the trailer, I guess, but I kind of like it. Nice. Very cool. Well, let's, uh, we don't even have to shut our truck off because we're going to get rid of the trailer. 350, and that's what was advertised. Well, oh, right on the dot. See if the trailer's gone or just, oh, it's still sitting there. Okay, cool. Well, that was cool. That, oh, what's there? We got some tire tracks up in the air. Well, there we are. So, um, I hopefully that uh, mod, the garage mod, is uploaded on Steam uh, Truckee properly. I'll try and confirm, and if it is, there'll be a link in the video. And if I get a chance tonight to finish this truck skin, I'll do that too. And uh, just see how that goes. But um, once again, as always, appreciate you guys following along. And um, yeah, to all you patrons out there, I guess I got to start doing more of these garages and get a few more of you on uh, door skins <laughs> on the uh, garage trucks. Anyway, as always, appreciate you following along. Take care and bye for now.